How's everybody doing on YouTube today? Uh, this will be another decently quick video, kind of like the last couple with the fish tank. Only I will be messing with this train here. This train is not Lego. It's a building block company. I actually got it from Wishlist. It's supposed to like resemble one of the Lego trains. The little high speed shuttle thing, but the colors are off. This thing keeps falling off the tracks, so I'm going to try to figure out how to make it where it doesn't. I know what it is already. The When they made it, they made it kind of cheap. But I'm going to spruce up the color, take all that blue out of there, and make it it's something different. So... So stay tuned, go like, subscribe, comment, and check out this video. Alright, so far I have tore this down enough. I could know what I need on the pieces. I took it out on that side already. And I've got some pieces here to switch them out. I'm going to go with black on the sides and the top. So I pulled out all my black. And we're going to get ready. I've been messing with this for a while. Pulled out some more white because I needed some. Got a bunch of pieces out. This is what I got so far. I really don't like the light on this camera. But it might change up a little bit on the top right there. I'm just trying to cover those buttons in a certain way. Probably just doing black. And then that black or that blue little stripe right there, I'm gonna cut it out with an exacto. But looks looks pretty good and it runs on the track really well. I'll show you that right now. Okay, let's see if this works like it's supposed to. I had to take the little piece off because it won't fit underneath that tunnel without it with it being on there but it's not going to be the one that's going through that tunnel all the time anyways and if we want to we just take that one piece off but let's test it out this one doesn't actually have a remote it just goes on its own so let's see okay it works good. Let's see if it'll go up this. Oh, it did. That's where it keeps falling off the tracks, right there. Like those front wheels. But it works. And it looks pretty sweet in the train station. Being all black like this. Alright, well, let's go on to the other three train car, or the other two train cars.
on the last one. Let's see if I can get this one done uh, pretty quick. Still working on this. It's actually the next day. Uh, pretty much finished this one, but what sucks is now I have to put that red line in this one because I started this one first, and I already did the the car, and that's the back of the car. We just got to finish up the top right here, put the wheels back on it, and call it good. And then do this one. I have to change, put all that red in there. So stay tuned for more. Okay, so I have finished the black train. I had to take the Hogwarts thing out of there because I got to raise it up just a little bit so the train can go underneath the, the bridge part. But here it is. Looks way better than that blue at the beginning. But we're going to test it out, see if it works, see if it falls off the tracks at all. And if so, I will have to re well, fix it up again. So let's see. Turn it on. Make sure it's on. And what's cool about this one is the lights light up in the front. Well, if they're hooked up. Not too sure. But... We'll start it out kind of slower. Maybe a little bit faster. It's got to pull all those cars now. Okay, that worked. Let's see if it falls off right here. Don't fall off. See, it needs more power. It has more power, but... And I need those rubber bands on the wheels that it has. This train is super loud and I don't know how to fix it. Okay, so 
go like, subscribe, and comment if you like this video and you like the mock I did on this, or revamp, I guess, is what you'd call it, of this train. If you liked it, go subscribe. That's all I can say. So, till the next video, peace out.